people say, oh, we have an epidemic, this is beyond epidemic. Fighting heroin together, hundreds of people poured into Hallen High School for tonight's Faces of Heroin. It's a particularly important topic in Hallen, which has the second highest number of overdoses of any place in Trumbull County. 27 First News reporter James Santelli tells us what tonight's speakers were looking to accomplish. It's our top story tonight at 10. It's time we talk. More than a half dozen speakers took the podium at Howland High School tonight. Judges, first responders, everyone sharing honestly. Tell real stories and help um, break the stigma of addiction. Hope begins here. Hope begins today. Hope begins right now. Lemma Green told the crowd about her brother dying to give people her story of what addiction can do. And to give them hope. I want people to have hope and know that, you know, if you need help, it's okay. Don't be ashamed. Ask for it. It's okay. Two years ago, nobody wanted to talk about heroin or the death of, of a loved one with heroin. But tonight, a different story. Howland's gymnasium filled with people, all learning about the support that's out there. You got a chance, man. You got a chance. And some in the crowd couldn't hold back their tears. This doesn't have to be a secret. You know, a lot of parents keep it as a secret that they're kids are on drugs. Doug Walker was one of those addicted, saying he just followed the cool kids in school. A lot of them cool kids are dead. Walker lost the mother of his daughter. As for him, he's three years in recovery. I came from pretty much the dumps, and uh, right now I have a good life, you know, one day at a time. And on this day, a reminder that no one has to fight addiction alone. In Howland, James Santelli, WKBN 27 First News. WKBN is committed to finding local solutions to the heroin crisis. We've launched a year-long public service campaign to raise awareness about the problem and also help come up with ways to solve it. We have a special heroin crisis section on WKBN.com. There you can see our in-depth reports from local people overcoming addiction, the resources to get help, and local and state efforts to fight the heroin epidemic.